Welcome to this short training video on the Fisher & Paykel Infant Resuscitation Mask. This video will show you mask sizing, mask hold, and mask seal. Please note that this video is intended to provide general guidance and is not a substitute for medical judgment in each instance about suitability of mask sizing, hold, or seal. Once you have set up your Neopuff, you will need to select the appropriate size mask. This is only to be used as a guide. Actual measurements should be taken for an ideal fit and optimum therapy delivery. Fisher & Paykel offers five sizes of infant resuscitation masks. For this baby, the mask shown is too big as it overlaps on the chin and the eyes. This mask is too small for this baby as it does not sufficiently cover the nose and mouth and will not provide a seal. This is the correct size mask for this baby. The mask rim is resting on the chin and it covers the mouth and nose without extending over the chin or onto the eyes. When using the two large sizes of the mask, pediatric and infant, seal is achieved when the OK or C hold position is applied. To achieve the OK or C hold, the thumb and index finger should form a C shape or look like the OK hand gesture around the top flat portion of the mask. Apply an even distribution of pressure supporting the outer edge and do not encroach onto the skirt of the mask. The third and fourth fingers should be under the chin slightly extending into the sniffing position. When using the smaller three sizes, neonatal, premature and micro-premature, seal is achieved when applying the two-point top hold. To achieve the two-point hold, apply even pressure using the thumb and index finger to the top flat portion of the mask where the silicone is thickest. Do not hold the stem of the mask. The fingers should not encroach onto the skirt of the mask. The third and fourth fingers should be under the chin slightly extending into the sniffing position. Begin by connecting the mask onto the TP circuit in a twisting motion, either clockwise or counterclockwise, until there is a secure fit. Position yourself at the baby's side or over the head. Both positions should leave the chest and abdomen unobstructed for visual monitoring. The infant should be on their back with their head in a neutral position. The baby's neck should be slightly extended, but not overextended, into the sniffing position to maintain an open airway. Place the edge of the mask at the tip of the chin. Your little finger should be on the chin tip to help guide the alignment of the mask as well as steady the hand. Roll the mask toward the bridge of the nose, avoiding the infant's eyes. Ensure you have the correct alignment so the mouth and nose are sealed. The Neopuff manometer will show set peep if seal is achieved. If a seal has not been achieved and you experience mask leak, reapply the mask using the appropriate technique. Finally, begin resuscitation as per your hospital protocol. Always refer to the user instructions supplied to the product for full setup instructions, warnings, contraindications, and explanations. Thank you for watching. Please contact your local representative for further information about these or any other Fisher & Paykel healthcare products or therapies. Or visit www.fphcare.com.